Uh, well, hi guys. So moving on from the last video clip, I'm going to be doing something else to come through this time. I'm going to make a liquid plant feed, which is really good for potatoes and anything that's fruiting. So obviously fruits and then tomatoes, peppers, anything like that really. So I'm going to get on and harvest a plastic bag's worth of this and then I'll go back to the plot and I'll make the liquid feed and I'll show you how I do it. So we're going back at the plot and now I'm going to make the comfy tea. Um, I use these barrels, I got them on the internet. I'll put a link below where I got them from. Uh, they make it a lot easier, but you can just do this in a, a normal bucket and just weigh all the comfy down with a um, stone. I'll show you how I do this method and then I'll explain it. So, I've got a big bag of comfy. Hessian sack. Get the comfrey, rip it up a bit, and put it in the sack. I'm going to fill it up so there's a fair amount in the sack. The more you put in, the stronger it's going to be. So I'll get on and do this, and I'll explain the next bit. Okay, so I've filled up the sack all the way full. Now I'm going to tie it off with a piece of string. really all there is to it. Like I said this is really going to be really high in potassium so it's good for things like fruit, potatoes, uh, tomatoes, peppers, that kind of stuff. Um, it's also got some nitrogen and phosphorus in it so it's a pretty good fertiliser and it's a pretty good uh, free replacement for um, tomato fertiliser. Um, lid on and leave it to sit for about a month now maybe stirring it every sort of week or so uh, and the reason why I have a lid and why I do it this way is because after a month this absolutely stinks like sewage so with the lid on it minimises it and I can just turn the tap on and that's it really um, and the other method I'm just get a bucket The other method would be getting a bucket like this, a nice big size, fill it up with comfrey leaves, um, weigh them down with a big slab, stone, something like that, fill the whole bucket to the top with water, and again you let it sit for about a month. Um, I would recommend putting something over the top because like I say it absolutely stinks and I wouldn't put it anywhere near the house, so it's far away from the house you can possibly get it, or like me I've got it in the allotment, so it's no worries. Uh, I've got another one here which um, has nettles in it. Nettle tea is really good for sort of anything leafy, so like lettuces, it's really good for brassicas and it's really good for sweet corn. So that's what I'll be using that for and the comfrey I'll be using for everything that fruits. So I've got all my fertilizer sorted now and I don't have to buy any. So see you later. <laughs> 